So far, we've established what design is, who it's used for, who creates it, and the stages of development. The final question we're going to look at, and the most important for us as construction engineers, is who manages it. We previously spoke about how the design is produced by technical consultants working on behalf of a project owner or contractor. Therefore, the project owner or contractor will need to manage this process. The role of the design manager is to work on behalf of the contractor or owner to manage the development of the project technical solution throughout the project lifecycle. We can break this role down into two parts that reflect the stage of the project lifecycle. The design manager has important roles in both the development of the technical solution and then its implementation. During development, the design manager will understand and interpret client requirements to develop the design strategy, manage the technical consultants who will do the design development, ensure costs, schedule and safety objectives met, and coordinate stakeholder review and approval. During implementation, the design manager will work with the construction team to implement the design during construction phase, manage any subcontractor or supplier detailed design, manage and control changes to the design through the RFI process, close out and resolve non-conformances, and coordinate the development of the as-built drawing set. The remainder of our course is broken down to reflect the two phases of design management, development and implementation. In section two, we'll focus on managing the development of the project technical solution. And in section three, we'll focus on managing its implementation and working closely with the construction team to ensure it's done correctly. Design management is becoming an increasingly important part of construction projects. Several key trends are driving this, including a shift away from traditional procurement methods so that now contractors are responsible for the detailed design, projects are becoming increasingly large and complex, they are becoming increasingly multidisciplinary as technology advances, there is an increased need and requirement to balance multiple objectives including safety, sustainability and the environment in addition to just cost and schedule. And finally, projects are completed to address an increasing number of stakeholder needs and requirements. All these trends mean effective design management is an indispensable part of construction projects. We need design managers who have a broad range of technical expertise, have a strong commercial acumen, and understand the contractual implications of their decisions, and can communicate effectively with clients, stakeholders, the construction team, and technical consultants.